So what is that? What are we about to do? Today we're going to do a picture um, of a Hennessy, um, Hennessy bottle on a mouse pad. I'm using a sub paper and all I did was I already did my image. I made it so that the image looks backwards on the paper, but when you put it on your material, your blank canvas, it's going to come out the right way. Again, I'm using a sub paper. Um, this was done uh, with the printer. Um, my Epson printer, and I'm you and I that I converted into sub into a sublimation printer. So this is sublimation print on sublimation paper. So all I'm gonna do is I cut it to fit my mouse pad, and all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna cover it onto the so it's fully covering the mouse pad like this. So it's fully covering it, and I'm gonna put some heat tape on it. Um, just put a couple of pieces of heat tape on it to keep it down, to hold it down. Put it on as tight as you can put it. That'll limit the ghosting, which is the white, the white spots on your on your canvas, blank canvas. Okay, so now that it's taped down, I'm gonna take my heat press. And it's on 40 degrees. 380. 380, 45 seconds. It's on three, my heat press is on 380 for 45 seconds. You could do it up to 400 degrees, but we're gonna try it with 380, 45 seconds. How do you normally do it when you do sublimation? I've never like done it. I'm not in my bottle. Your yeah, your bottles. What about it? How do you normally do it? I, I have to wrap the paper around it and then I tape it up. Oh. <laughs> I thought you was just asking. I just want my video just to be like showing the process without me talking. Yeah, I just figured to cover in blanks because it's 45 seconds of talking and you didn't take that good. It didn't, it's, it moved. Yeah. But it still came Oh, out. I like that. Oh, that's pretty. Oh, shit. It slid man. a little bit, but I like it. Bring it back. Oh. <laughs> it moved a little bit, but I like that. That thing popped. Oh, y'all talking court. I said, oh, shit, man. We can edit all that out. Mm -hmm. That is nice. Did you you should have uh, uh, made it a little bit bigger than the actual thing. So that way, even if you didn't tape it right, it yeah, it even if you didn't tape it right, it would have uh, still, still filled it up. But for the first time, that's actually nice. Look at them colors. Mm -hmm. Yeah, thing popping. I now like I it. I got to make the cup again because the cup, I didn't leave it in long enough, so it's not this dark. Oh, man. See, heat press is better. Yeah, I'm thinking about getting one. I don't want to have to come over here every time I want to use one. Oh, okay. But yeah, that'll go good. If I can, I can definitely, like, if I'm doing, like, T-shirts that we're doing. Mm -hmm. It'll pop even more with these shirts. 
because she said it takes the whole border. Mm -hmm. So for him on out, if I make these shirts for somebody, I just go over there and print on this because now I know that the color is going to pop out. I don't have to do no cutting because I want the whole border. Mm -hmm. And it's supposed to be big on sweatshirts. Mm -hmm. So this will go real good on her machine. Not that it doesn't pop out good on mine, but sublimation, them colors really stand out. So I think I'm going to do that now for these shirts. I have to buy some film, some film paper to test out something else. Another theory I'm going to try to do. Then I can do like uh, stuff like that mm -hmm. where the words are spaced out and stuff like that and it doesn't have the background. You need to slide that over some more. This oh, yeah. oh yeah. Slide it over some more and lift it up some. Here. Yeah. And go up just a little bit. No, you went up too far. Here. I can't see them. Yeah, right there. Hey, Selena, can you do me one more thing? Mm -hmm. Bring me the blue tape. The blue tape. Oh, the, the thick. Yeah. What is that tape? It's just regular. It takes heat. You sure? Yeah, I put it in my um, oven. My convection oven. This is My convection oven went to 400. This is going to be hotter. It's literally pressing, so it's going to be get the full 400. So, if you mess up my thing, you're paying for it. I know you ain't talking about it. I like that printer. I just don't want to spend so much money on one. I know I need to, but... Like what printer? The, the one either, that you saw? It, well, actually, the one I see, I still can't find too, too many people to do it. So that's another reason why I haven't tried to get it. But even if I get yours and then I get the My film. My printer won't expensive. Yeah, I know. But it still makes me feel a certain way to flip it. Oh. Still makes me feel a certain, certain way. 45 seconds again. Because mm -hmm. it's the same thing. Just for a Some kind of way about what? Spending that much money on something. That's how I feel. Unless you're making sales, I hate to spend money and you ain't making no sales. But I like that pad though. I just wish I, I can't, didn't think it was gonna come out. I'm too good. OCD that I couldn't have this sitting around because it'll irritate. Just like the bottle is it the tumbler that I did, it's irritating me. Most likely she's gonna have it. It ain't gonna mm -hmm. last on my desk. Well then you it want the tumbler so too? Last. You want I the tumbler too? The tumbler. Okay, you get the tumbler. Because I'm not happy with the tumbler. I won't even look at it. I'm really OCD. It's pretty. It's nice. It's just not the right color. What you mean it ain't the right color? It's not dark like this. It's too light because I didn't look at it. Oh, the tumbler. I'm talking about the tumbler. The big reveal. No. Oh, I thought you was trying to cheat. Told you one more tape one won't mess up your your thing. Oh, did it come up? Yes, it did. Put it back over here. Because the camera been running the entire time while we was talking. Can you put it back in the camera? It's hot. Can you put it back in the camera? <laughs> Just try to hit that focus on the camera. Push the screen. Just touch the middle of the screen. 
Oh, I could see me doing this all day. All this is that fat better than doing tumblers. I'm going to buy some more so I can have plenty to do. So you're going to do the cut next? <laughs> Putting it back in there because we don't know if it's long enough. It feels like it. What? That might have been Can enough. Have uh, sure. I think I'd rather have a heat press in that convention oven. Because I can only do cups in that. I can't do everything else like this. And my, my thing is wasn't even big enough to do the mouse pad in one good try. Eventually, I'm going to need a bigger one. That's why I said if I get one, I'm going to get a bigger one. But I make it do for what it what it does. Because I just slide If it's whatever it is, I just slide them and just move it on. It's still good enough. To, I'm going to have this for a while. I don't. See the need to change. See, it's better now. See how deep that is. You could just rip it. Hmm. Good. So, if you're going to be using my heat press yeah. all the time. And you don't see the whites? Yeah, you do. You know, I bought the heat press. You buy the, the printer for me. You know, it's an even yeah, trade-off. Bring the other stuff over here. We'll... Let me put it in the camera real quick. really want to touch it too too much first time yeah i did this all by myself okay i'm glad yeah 